वेलकम व्यूवर्स इन दिस वीडियो विल सी द एसी थ्रू द रेसिस्टेंस ओनली व्हेन द व्हेन द एसी करंट इज फ्लोइंग थ्रू द रेसिस्टर व्हाट इज द बिहेवियर ऑफ द वोल्टेज करंट व्हाट इज द एवरेज पावर व्हाट इज द इंस्टेंटेनियस पावर दिस थिंग वी विल डिस्कस इन दिस वीडियो नाउ कंसीडर देन अल्टरनेटिंग क्वांटिटीज अप्लाइड टू द रेसिस्टिव सर्किट आर शोन इन द डायग्राम सो द आवर रेसिस्टर इज अवेलेबल द अल्टरनेटिंग करंट the alternating quantity that is alternating voltage ac voltage is applied to the resistor vt this it is the current flowing through the resistor because of alternating quantity it is vt it because the current or voltage changes with the given time in this resistor so this is a applied voltage vm the sine voltage the so positive cycle and negative cycle now we'll see this current waveform this is a current waveform in case of resistor both current and voltage are in phase in phase mean current and voltage starts at zero degree itself there is no leading or lagging due to the magnitude it slightly reduces but current also in phase with the voltage so this is the this is the amplitude of voltage vm this is the amplitude of current im so this is nothing but v of t waveform of the applied voltage this is i of t waveform of the current now we'll analyze how this current and voltage are in phase with the both are in phase in case of resistive circuit in terms of equation we will analyze the resistive circuit both current and voltage are, are in phase we'll see we will analyze in terms of the equation now v of t equal to vm sin omega t that is we'll take it as equation 1 this is applied voltage the voltage applied to the circuit is vm sin omega t we'll take this equation number 1 by using the ohms law by ohms law v of t equal to r into i of t v equal to ir there is a ohms law given so v of t equal to r into i of t both are in terms of time period now we'll substitute this v of t from this equation vm sin omega t this v of t is replaced by this vm sin omega t that is equal to r into i of t bring this r in the denominator vm by r sin omega t equal to i of t what is vm by r v by r is nothing but current now it's rewritten like this i of t equal to vm by r into sin omega t this term is written in left hand side this term is written in right hand side it is rewrite so this vm by r is nothing but im voltage by resistance v by r is nothing but i im so i of t equal to im sin omega t so that is given vm by r is nothing but the maximum value of current im this r is the resistance of the circuit i of t is instantaneous current passing through the circuit instantaneous current mean at given instant now we can refer this equation 1 and 2 equation 1 v of t equal to vm sin omega t i of t equal to im sin omega t so the angle is omega t both angles are same so that means that this current and voltage are in phase with each other so that is given comparing equation 1 and 2 we find that the alternating voltage and current are in phase with each other that only we refer already referred in the waveform so by analyzing these two equation we come to know that both are in phase now we will find the instantaneous power now we'll go for the instantaneous power of the r circuit so the instantaneous power instantaneous power mean at given instant average power means by considering the entire cycle p equal to v of t into i of t power equal to voltage into time the voltage into current the formula is available so v of t is vm sin omega t i of t is im sin omega t so it is vm into im sin square omega t so the sin square omega t can be written as 1 minus cos omega cos 2 omega 2 divided by 2 so we got vm im into 1 minus cos 2 omega 
divided by 2. We will go for further simplification. So, the 2 is taken outside. So, P equal to Vm Im divided by 2 into 1 minus cos 2 omega t. Now, multiply the term inside. So, Vm Im divided by 2 minus Vm Im divided by 2 into cos 2 omega t. This term is multiplied inside. So, from that you can easily see that this is the DC term. There is no cos or sign is available. So, this is the AC term or harmonic part. The DC part and AC part. Now, we will go to the average power. The derivation for average power. So, the average power equal to 1 divided by t 0 to t p into dt. So, the average power means we need to integrate for a given time. Then we will get the total average power. Normally, average means we will take i1 plus i2 plus i3 divided by n. Like that, we are going for integration. By integrating the entire cycle, we will get the average. So, 1 by p, 1 by pi, 0 to pi, p into dt. Now, the power we already calculated. So, 1 by pi, 0 to pi, Vm Im divided by 2 minus Vm Im divided by 2 cos 2 omega 2 into dt. The instantaneous power what we calculated earlier. Now, this Vm Im by 2 is available in both the terms. So, we will take it as outside. So, Vm Im divided by 2, already 1 pi is there. So, Vm, Vm Im divided by 2 pi. So, here we have 1 minus cos 2 omega t into d omega t. Now, we will go for the integration. So, Vm Im divided by 2 pi, the integral 1 that is d omega t is omega t minus cos 2 omega t. Integral cos 2 omega t is sin 2 omega t divided by 2. Now, substitute the limit the pi minus sin 2 pi divided by 2. The lower limit is 0. So, sin 0 also 0, this also 0. So, they are not substituted. So, the sin 2 pi also 0. So, only we have pi. Vm Im divided by 2 pi into pi. This pi pi got cancelled. So, we have Vm Im divided by 2. So, in this lower only upper limit substituted, lower limit is 0. So, this value becomes 0, sin 0 also 0. So, that not written. Only the upper limit is substituted. Again, in the upper limit, this value also 0. Sin 2 pi is 0. Now, Vm Im divided by 2 pi can be written as Vm by root 2 into Im by root 2. This 2 is written is root 2 into root 2. Root 2 into root 2 is nothing but 2. So, what is Vm by root 2? That is RMS value. Im by root 2 is also RMS value, current and voltage. Vm by root 2 is VRMS. Im by root 2 is IRMS. Now, we got the expression for average power. So, in this video, we analyze the when the AC current is flowing through the resistor, what is the behavior of current and voltage? From the equation, we analyze that both current and voltage are in phase with each other. And also, we got the expression for instantaneous power and average power. Thank you.